Howdy y'all, I'm Around the Wheel, you're watching Lemmings to the Tribes, and today we're moving on to the Cave Limb Tribe. Last time we finished up Shadow, and now we're on Tribe number 6, which once completed will put us halfway through the dang old game. Can't believe we're there already, and I gotta tell you, I'm having a blast. I was wrong about this game. I think I'm ready to admit 20 episodes in, I've been wrong about this game for two decades. It is a blast. I don't care how jank it is. On the whole, you know, except for a few bum levels, which, you know, every Lemmings game, every Lemmings pack is going to have, uh, I'm having myself a good old time, and I imagine that will continue as we go into the Cave Limb Tribe, the Cavellum Tribe, with Audex Powder. All we have for this one is Stompers, Builders, and Club Bashers. Uh, Club Bashers makes sense for the uh, for a Homo Lemmingus Erectus Tribe. Here we go. So what happened to... Ooh, this is a spooky looking. Alright, I, I kind of... I dig the vibe here. Okay, so so water is not going to be uh, safe. Ah, here we go. We're making it to a decidedly old school type of limbing tribe. Okay, so what's going on here? Oh, hey, wow! Okay, we're being flung into orbit by by Triceratopsis. Okay, so at some point we're going to want to dig to uh, to prevent that from being a thing. Well, how about right now? Yeah, that's a... Oh, that may prove to be a fatal drop. No, it's fine. Okay. <laughs> well, then, all right. Okay, well, then let's keep on stomping down. And I think uh, that gets our first level out of the way, as long as we have a, a solid route. So, yeah, hopefully, uh, hopefully that doesn't figure into too many levels. Any mechanic like that is going to be severely jankified but this looks like it's working out pretty well looks like the pace looks like the pace allows for lemmings multiple lemmings to be flung into it without oh hey oh oh i didn't realize there was something in the dark oh there's a there are eyes in the dark swiping my lemmings away oh well we cannot have that that's terrible that that's just and that's just wrong okay so now okay now we're kind of uh, now our hand is forced. We have to we have a situation going here. Okay, if he flings them into the wall, I imagine that will prove fatal. I'm, the third time is definitely not the charm, as far as this goes. So I kind of want to see it in action, but once they get flung into this wall, that's going to unless I just have to do nothing to solve this level. Is this a Luigi wins by doing nothing kind of situation? I kind of doubt it. Oh yeah, see, okay, that's a fatal drop right there. So that's that's where we don't want the bad times happen. Okay, so let's kind of this is workable. This is workable, I think. The stomper works pretty quickly and efficiently. Quickly and efficiently. I'm kind of speaking a little muddled. Very good to always enunciate. So all right, so we want once we get down to here. I think what we want to do is I think the best probably course of action would be to just immediately stomp it out tamp it down solid and then club bash out there we go all right yeah pretty simple level once you realize what's going on okay this is a trap I'm gonna have to watch out for with my with my uh, old man eyes because uh, I did not see that I did not realize that, that you know there could you know it's nine o'clock. Where are your lemmings? Do you know where your lemmings are? Yeah, they're being swiped by a madman. There could be somebody out on the streets taking away your lemmings as we speak. And you could not even know it. You could be off swimming in your green water in your lovely uh, background pool. Just not a care in the world. And there could be, there could be an, an, a pair of evil eyes uh, swiping your lemming children. So, but yeah, that one was not too bad. That's not a, that's not too bad a first level. It's definitely not a tutorial style first level, but it's, uh, it's, it looks like Cave Limb Tribe might get a little serious judging by the tone of this first level. So I'm, I'm, a, I'm, I'm going to proceed with caution on this one, but I did, I did enjoy that first level and I did enjoy that the, that the flinging dinosaur worked without too much uh jank okay yeah 60 women i was like did a lemming die somehow that i didn't keep track of did, did we get the cannon glitch but in dinosaur form 
not so much no that did not happen here today so next level one down nine to go for the cave limbs we're already off to a pretty solid start i would say with that tribe next up we have successive division looks like we're going to be playing plinko for a chance at up to ten thousand dollars all we have is stompers and scoopers so yeah let's see let's uh, four sc scoopers three stompers we got kind of an alternating thing going scooper stomper scooper stomper let's see what happens okay we got two we got two tribes here well first of all well this seems to be a pretty simple division of labor uh two two things going here okay all right so first of all well seems pretty obvious to me we're gonna stomp right down the middle okay so but and at one at some point or another ah yes i see i see i see said the blind man some are going to be going to the right some are going to be going to the left and i believe this is where we scoop and then stop okay uh, okay well we don't want to get we don't get want to get too crazy dividing our labor because we only have okay so we used one stomper scooper scooper and then okay yeah we're gonna run out of stuff before we get to the bottom too long this this little division of labor could prove to be a problem so because what well, yeah, and also aiming stuff in the wrong spot could be a problem. Okay, but, but, okay, once we get them all into one, okay, yeah, it was just me screwing up a stupid thing. But as soon as we get this going, okay, yeah, some of them, the only, the only time we're going to have lemmings working at odds, working two sides of the room, okay, is going to be here, scooper, scooper, because then we can scoop out to a side. And then stomp. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Pretty, pretty nice. Okay. I'm agreeing with it, and it's agreeing with me. Okay, yeah, this is going to be a big problem if I do it wrong. Okay, good. Okay, yeah, they're stunned, but as always, it's perfectly okay. So now, yeah, here we go. Let's have somebody scoop out this one. Oh, that's a bit high. Okay. Ah, yes, okay, so then we stomp out. Oh, yeah, we still, we have tasks left over, actually. That's, oh, all right, I'm fine with that. Okay, yeah, and then we, okay, as long as there isn't a trap waiting for us in the offing. Okay, yeah, okay, so, so see, I missed this again. Okay, yeah, so you don't want to go that way, and you probably don't want to go that way either. Okay, so once you get in here, you want to scoop into here, and then, okay, yeah, all right. I missed the eyes again. Ooh, the evil eye. Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. Creepy. Creepy and very, very, very easy to miss with this tiny DOS box window and my and my failing old man vision. Uh, that that trap is gonna get me plenty of times before we finish off this tribe, I can assure you. Alright, so you scoopy? All right, and you also Scoopy the Poopy. We're gonna be we're gonna be poop scooping our hearts out here. Okay, so yeah, we want to go into. Okay, death awaits us. Where? Uh, here. Yeah. Uh, so we want to go down into here, I think, with the scoop. Okay, the the scoop would be. All right. All right. Yeah, that's a problem, so... Okay, something is happening. It's not allowing us to scoop and... Uh... Okay, yeah, well, and then I messed it up, so... Oh my gosh, okay. This is actually... <laughs> this is an easy level to figure out, but it's a little bit hard to execute, and I'm thinking it's because of the pattern of the rocks, the way the rocks kind of look. Scooping to the left is not really ideal once you get in there, but and it's kind of the best way to go about things, though, honestly. Uh, unless we want to get, unless we want to get to the right and then the left, is this a trap? Th that's worth knowing as well. The, 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 there's a lot of a lot of stuff in the prehistoric era that really gives me pause. Uh, and I'm and I'm very worried about a lot of it. Uh, it's my job to worry as the appointed savior of the lemmings. 
It's my job to worry about these kinds of things. I wouldn't be a good living savior if I didn't. Why did you? Oh, because I stopped. I didn't scoop. Okay. I'm just too busy talking and being a talker. You know, talk is cheap. Talk is what gets lemmings killed. You actually have to be up to the task. So yeah, I can see why stomping through that would not exactly be the most effective means of conveyance. But okay, once we get in there, this is going to be tough because getting in these little nooks is uh, not easy. You got lemmings running around, crowding up the joint, clowning. Not taking their lives seriously. Come on. You're on a career track here, Mr. Lemming. This is this is not what you want out of your life, I don't think. So let's uh, let's be very careful and mindful of our choices here. Okay, so yeah, we want to go through here. Alright. Alright, we don't want successive division, we want successful division. <laughs> oh, Ooh, you ratty little lemmings. You, you rats, you rodents, you varmints. There we go. Okay, and then I think one ought to be good in the here. There we go. Assuming this isn't, assuming this coconut tree isn't going to kill us, you know, we've got exits on both sides we can wander to. That's beautiful. Okay, there we go. Okay. The tree is safe. You can, you can drop off the tree. There do seem to be... Uh, drips of blood on the edge of the tree. It does look like this plant has taken lives before. Uh, and, you know, that's between the plant and God, you know. Only God forgives, uh, so they say. So, we're gonna, we're gonna let them speed up to the exit. It looks like they're all... Are they, like, bowing down to the exit God here? <laughs> What's going on with this exit? They're just, like, they bowing out, like, that's my time. And thank you very much. Be sure to tip your lemming waitress. Try the try the veal sarni. It's the best in the city. All right, let's speed this up. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here and let's do one more caveman level. Cave, caveman, cave woman, cave lemming, men, women, and lemmings of all stripes are gonna see success here today. That last lemming always scares me. It's that it's that little bow out trick that they're doing. But that wasn't such a bad level. You just gotta watch out for the eyeballs. And <laughs> if they fill every level in this tribe with eyeballs, then I can guarantee you I'm gonna fall for it 11 times out of 10. So let's see what do we have here. Mortal men doomed to die. A minute 30 to beat this one, man. We gotta move fast on this one, but we only have limited items, so we're gonna be working a very specific solution here. Looking forward to this one. You don't get a lot of time crunches in Lemmings 2. It doesn't really... The nature of the game doesn't really suit itself to that. So I'm interested... Oh no. Trampolines. Get out of town with this. That is a sinister looking skeleton. Oh my gosh. Okay, so let's see the natural path that it follows here. What happened? Oh, they are coming out. They are coming out like gangbusters. Okay, so uh, let's get a jumper going, first of all. Okay, boing, boingy. Okay, that's death. We don't want that. Okay, yeah, if we get that going, that's a bad place to jump. Okay, so then, let's see. Let's, let's try. All right, so, oh no, 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 no. If we do that... Yeah, lemmings are going to start pouring out over the... Okay, and that's going to result in death. Lots of different kinds of death. Ooh, boy, we got to... I do like how the platforms look. At... Oh, it's just gray tiles. I thought it was like round rocks shuffled next to each other. Okay, so... Interesting, interesting, interesting. Uh, I have no thoughts about this currently. Uh, 52 lemmings, 49 to be saved. That's not, I'm going to guess, a gold standard... Uh, attempt. So what do we even want to get going here? Like, uh... Um, let's try being very quick. Okay, yeah. And then, uh... Uh, this guy needs to jump over this. Okay. Wow, that is quick. Okay, we've got how many jumpers here? we got four. And if they can... If they can successfully jump out of the mushroom pit here... Then we've done it, and I feel like I've cheesed it. Why do I feel like I've cheesed this level? <laughs> oh, this was ultra quick. Oh, now I'm a little scared. Was I supposed to do it that quickly? I feel really good about myself, keeping it very localized and uh, 
Ooh, now I feel like we have time for one more level. That was super fast. <laughs> um, no stompers used there. Just one platformer. And uh, it all worked out. Boy, uh, maybe that was the intended solution. But I get the distinct feeling that I did indeed cheese that one. So, yeah, we're going to go for one more. At the risk of... Uh, at the risk of overextending ourselves, yes, we're going to go for one more. A stomping good time. Uh, ten stompers. That bears out. It's also a scooping good time, it looks like. Stompers and scoopers. There's a lot of downward mobility in this cave limb tribe. But we got one roper. One roper and one platformer. I'm sure going to be used in very specific contexts and very specific locations. Okay, we're all safe to start out with. That makes me happy. Okay, but I gotta watch out for the eyeballs of death, I'm sure. Where is our exit? Oh, it's only right here. That's, that's not the worst thing. That's... No, uh, something is going on here. Okay, okay, well, there's this. Alright, so some of them are gonna get flung. We only have two... Okay, this is just all... This is just uh, the greenery of death down here. Um, what do we have going for us here? So, okay, if they go down, what's the, what's the point of the, I don't get this. What's the point of the, of the roper and the platformer? Because if the dinosaur just flings them over here, they're going to go up. This could be a trap. I'm going to investigate that, but that could be a trap. Uh, but we want to get scooping first of all. Okay, I want to see what happens here. All right, they get flung over, over Mushroom Avenue here. Okay, well, it doesn't really do them a lot of good. Uh, actually, it does them a huge lot of good. Uh, okay, what what's going on over here? Why are you going this way? I hope you're okay wandering off that way, but, you know, I can't, can't pay attention to everybody all the time. All right, here we go. So, they go in there. All right, um... All right, I do see how this could be problematic to a degree. Um, this one is really easy, just period. Uh, okay, yeah, just go ahead and... Yeah, go ahead and waste my rope. That's exactly what I like having you do, is wasting my rope. Who gave you permission to waste my rope? You are... Oh, my gosh. Get sunned. Okay, so you go over here. You get whipped over onto Mushroom Hailfire Peaks, and then... Okay, so you go down in here. Can I have you stop? What's, what's the climate look like here? Okay, so this could prove to be... Fa Is this an exit right here? I see the same kind of torch right here. Is I think it's just decoration. I think they're just being... I think they're just being decorative. They're just being silly. Silly lemmings. Okay. All right. Um, I feel like if I'm strategic about it, I could maybe scoop. Um, I'm gonna keep scooping. Actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna scoop and see what happens. I don't think that worked out. Um, so if they go down here, I can kind of save everybody by. Okay, they walk up over blah, 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 blah. So, one roper. One roper could conceivably do this. Let's go ahead and, uh. Let's. Okay, that is actually not working. Okay, I'm gonna have to get right in the middle of here, aren't I? Okay, this is a problem. Okay, no, they're all getting stunned. Okay, fine. That's good. Okay, so. All right, the problem then is they go over here and they walk all the way up, 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 up. And then they go into, they go into here. Well, no, that's not a problem because I can just scoop a staircase out for them. That's nice, okay. Okay, let's see just how low this goes. All right, okay, I think I've made a successful staircase out for them. As long as I've done that, I've won the level. Then, uh, okay, this guy over here got up to some shenanigans, apparently. I don't know. I don't know why he's just wandering around being weird. But, okay, yeah, it's it's simple enough. Okay, well, he'll have to get out on his own then. But there is there are plenty of tools at his disposal to do that. So, oh my gosh. 
I did not rope in a great spot, did I? Oh, <laughs> right in that little nook. Gross, gross, disgusting. I hate it. Thanks, I hate it. Copyright Lindsay Ellis. Okay, now this looks a lot better than the last time I did it, and there's only two lemmings down here wandering around in this little mucky muck. I have a much better, I can jockey for a much better position. There we go. All right, now everybody is to the end. A rope only needed to save, like, two lemmings at most, uh, but we can fast forward to the end and get the rest to safety. Another easy level for the Cave Limbs Tribe. I'm enjoying this one so far. It's kind of dark and gloomy, the aesthetic, but I kind of dig the, I kind of dig the puzzle song. There's a lot of scooping and stomping involved in Cave Life, but, you know, that's just, that's just true to history. Like... When we, when we do research about the Neanderthals, we find that that's what they did. They spent most of their expen their not their expenses, <laughs> their, their existences, they spent most of their money on scooping and stomping. Uh, the bucket economy back in the Neanderthal days was just <laughs> out of hand. This is the worst bit ever. Oh my god. 